History about William Branham. The following has been written and said of Brother Branham. The ending of World War II marked the beginning of a phenomenal growth period for the Pentecostal people around the world. It was perhaps the greatest healing revival ever witnessed in the history of the world. The person universally acknowledged as the revival's father and pace setter was William Branham. The sudden appearance of his miraculous healing campaigns in 1946 set off a spiritual explosion in the Pentecostal movement which was to move to Main Street USA by the 1950s and give birth to the broader charismatic movement in the 1960s which currently affects every denomination in the country. The Full Gospel Men's Voice, now Full Gospel Businessmen's Fellowship International, in its February 1961 issue wrote, In Bible days there were men of God who were prophets and seers, but in all the sacred records none of these had a greater ministry than that of William Branham, a prophet and seer of God. Branham has been used by God in the name of Jesus to raise the dead. The late worldwide evangelist Tommy Osborne said, William Branham came our way as a prophet of God and showed us in the 20th century precisely the same things that were shown us in the Gospels. The Holy Spirit vindicated the ministry of William Branham time and time again by infallible proofs, such as the miraculous healing of the United States Congressman William D. Upshaw at the age of 84, after 66 years of being a paraplegic while bound to a wheelchair and crutches. The Congressman who served eight years in Congress from 1919 to 1927, wrote a widely dispersed pamphlet that you can download and enjoy today that detailed the miraculous presence of the Holy Spirit that came down and healed him during a healing campaign of Brother Branham and Ern Baxter. The congressman wrote the following, Then the Lord sent William Branham, Ern Baxter, at his side, with their ministry of healing in Calvary's crimson tide. Then suddenly Calvary Temple was lit with heaven's flame. I threw away my crutches and walked in Christ's dear name. Yesterday, today, forever, Christ, thank God the same, my Savior and my healer, oh praise his matchless name. Just 84, 84 years young, speak three and four times a day, preached the gospel of the Christ who saved me, stood by me on bed seven years and made me happy, and then took me off of the crutches that I had used for 59 years, and now joy is not over. Praise the Lord. Remember, I'm sending this folder to every congressman and senator, the president and his wife, now sending it this week to the King of England for whom he prayed, Winston Churchill, and I'm going to send one to Joseph Stalin. God Amen. have mercy. Amen. Amen. In 1950, a picture was taken of William Branham that contains a supernatural light, which we believe to be the same pillar of fire that led the children of Israel out of Egypt and to the Promised Land. We believe it is the same light that struck St. Paul down to the ground on his road to Damascus. Today the black and white photograph is on file at the United States Library of Congress in Washington, D.C. The picture can also be found easily on the library's website. In 1950 there was indisputable evidence that the supernatural light struck the lens of the camera and was burned onto the film. Today, that picture still stands as a witness of God confirming Brother Branham's ministry. In closing, we encourage you to invest time into listening to the ministry of William Branham, for we believe he was God's prophet to our age, the final messenger of God before the great tribulation period. Please don't ignore this messenger from God, for his ministry was the last sign to the Gentiles before the rapture, as Luke 17.30 foretold. There are over 1,100 audio sermons available for you to listen to at Branham.org. These sermons have transformed millions of lives, including mine, through the work of the Spirit of God. Our website, brightofchristohio.com, has links to two more teaching videos about the ministry of God in William Branham. The first, Three Prophecies of William Branham, teaches how to recognize a true prophet of God based upon the Bible. 
and it shows three prophecies given by William Branham that are either fulfilled or in the process of being fulfilled. The second video, Thus Saith the Lord, Future Prophecies of William Branham, shows prophecies that will come to pass and include prophecies about the United States, Rome and the Vatican, advances in science, the mark of the beast, and reassurance for true Christians. May each of you believe and experience the words of God from 2 Chronicles 20, verse 20. Believe in the Lord your God, so shall you be established. Believe his prophets, so shall you prosper. If you would like more Bible teaching about prophets and the ministry of William Branham, please contact us. God bless you, and may Jesus Christ be the desire of your heart.